Hello, my name is Elizabeth Capito, and I am a fifth year PhD student at Teachers College of Columbia University in the Econ and Ed program. I am also a senior research assistant at CCRC, the Community College Research Center, which is also housed at Teachers College. Um, this poster presentation is on a paper that was written for CCRC um, in collaboration with Peter Grosta. Uh, the title is Should Community College Students Earn an Associate Degree Before Transferring to a Four-Year Institution? Um, so basically, we were just trying to figure out what the impact of earning an associate's degree is on the future outcomes of a transfer student once they get to the four-year institution. Um, previous studies which have looked at this really only focus on the descriptive um, estimates through OLS regression. Um, however, obviously we know OLS is often plagued by selection bias or problems. In order to kind of unpack that, um, we do several things. First, we limit our analysis to students who uh, transfer with between 50 and 90 community college credits. Uh, this allows us to uh, really compare students who are similar, or we think, are similar in their intent. We're dropping students who only came to the college and took a few credits and then left or transferred right away. So these students really are all on the same path and could have potentially earn this degree. Um, we also control for the time of transfer, since we know um, if you transfer early or if you transfer late, these can greatly and significantly impact your probability of graduating from the four year within a certain time period. Um, finally, we use propensity score matching to kind of control for those um, unobservables by matching people on um, so our results, um, using data from a single state, uh, this community college system, uh, are as follows. Uh, basically, we find that earning an associate's degree um, in an associate of arts program or an associate of science program has a significant increase on the probability that you will graduate from a uh, four-year institution with a bachelor's degree within six years of entering the community college. Um, specifically, we find about a 9.5 percentage increase as compared to non -earners. Um We do not find any significant impact, however, on the likelihood of BA completion between AAS earners and people who were in the AAS programs but did not earn that degree. Um, so we conclude, of course, that there are positive and large impacts for earning the transfer-oriented degrees, um, but not so much for the career-oriented career degrees. Sorry, vocational-oriented degrees. Um, so moving forward, we're going to try to just unpack a little bit about why these differences might be found. And um, among these hypotheses for why, you know, we include signaling uh, that people who earn these degrees in the Associate of Arts programs um, or Associate of Science programs might be able to positively select into their institution at the four-year level. Um, and that there also might be some sort of course cohesion structure um, going on where people who are on these program in these programs and complete them are more prepared because they have um, actually gone through the program, gotten the right credits, and stayed on track. 